your friends. I trust you all are well and that you've had an amazing week thus far. Friends, I'd like to start us off with a scripture from Psalms 118 verse 24. And it says, This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. So friends, today I'd like to encourage us all by starting our days off choosing joy. Friends, I know it is not an easy thing to say or to outwork, but friends, when we apply that and we, we renew our minds daily, it's like with anything, friends, if you apply something on a consecutive and a continuous basis, you will eventually see that thing come to pass. So friends, by renewing your mind daily, the task becomes easier in choosing joy. But in saying that, friends, I want to just reiterate and remind you that you might not always see change in your circumstance, but you will most likely and most probably see change within yourselves by choosing joy because you are not placing all your focus and trust in that situation but you are focusing it on pure joy and that joy friends comes from Jesus Christ so friends I just want to read this quote from Kay Warren it says joy is the settled assurance that God is in control of all the details of our lives the quiet confidence that ultimately everything is going to be all right and the determined choice to praise God in all things friends no matter our circumstance we need to place our faith and our trust in him and by doing so friends we will have that ultimate joy Choosing joy means recognizing our weaknesses and relying on God's infinite strength. In moments of struggle, turn to Him and witness how He restores your joy, friends. Friends, when Paul was in prison with no hope of release, he wrote that rejoice in the Lord always. Friends, his circumstances didn't dictate his joy. His focus is. And the same goes for us, friends. We need to always be joyful, no matter the circumstance. Friend, when we get the revelation of that, it becomes so much easier to choose joy. I want to encourage you, friends, remember to get up daily and start off by thanking the Lord for this day that He has made. And let us rejoice in it and be glad. Friends, I trust that this was of encouragement and that you will get up choosing joy. Bless you.